Cause clean is neater than dirty, and dirty's meaner than clean. Let's all lend a helping hand, Gojira can't do it alone. Just spit his fire to fly around, and burn the sludge that's on the ground. Yep, that's a little Godzilla-themed parody of the Super Mario Sunshine commercial that premiered when I was a kid. When I first saw that, I just knew that I had to do, like, a little parody of it, and I've been doing it, like, ever since. But here's the funny thing, the amusing thing about this story. By the time Super Mario Sunshine first came out, and I saw that commercial, I hadn't seen Godzilla vs. Hedora yet. Yeah. So I, I made up that song just basically on the fly, imagining, like, how Godzilla could be implemented into the game. So imagine my surprise when I saw Godzilla vs. Hedora for the first time, and not only does Godzilla actually use his fire breath to burn the sludge that Hedora leaves on the ground, but he actually uses his fire breath to fly. I seriously cannot believe that I friggin' called that. But I honestly cannot believe that it actually made its way into an official Godzilla movie, because I'm a kid. You were... When you're a kid, you can come up with fantastic ideas... But nobody takes you seriously because you're a kid. <laughs> and Mario fell asleep. <laughs> Anyways. When we last left off, we had basically get done the last episode of Noki Bay. But now, we're going to do the blue coins and the hundred coins, as well as the secret shine sprite of Noki Bay. Now, effectively... I'm pretty sure that we can do most of the blue coins from episode 6, and we can also do the 100 coins from episode 6 as well, but uh, the last four coins will have to be done in episode 8, so we're just going to basically uh, do it like this. I think Noki Bay is like the only, the only world where you can't get Yoshi, like, at all, ever. Let's see. I think that I'm gonna kinda wanna do this, like, as promptly as possible, so... First, I'm gonna go get the turbo nozzle and get the blue coin that I... that's up there. Just so I can get those rings out of the way. Wow, look at that! The waterfall's making a rainbow, isn't that pretty? Oh, that's gorgeous. God, I keep finding new and beautiful things about this game! Look, guys, I'm gonna be honest. I'm not exactly the uh, biggest guy when it comes to uh, graphics and whatnot. As far as I'm concerned, I have a very different definition of when a game looks like shit. I mean... Basically, like, depending on the graphical style that the game is going for, even the most outdated graphics can still look good to me because they fit with the game's charm. They add to the they add a level of charm to the game, and they fit with the game's aesthetic. So, when it comes to new-gen consoles basically boasting more and more powerful machines that could display better and better graphics, I don't really care all that much because this this right here still looks great to me. Most of these, most of this environment is just textures on walls, but it looks so good to me. I honestly don't care. Ah, dang it. In a lot of ways, I would really like to just press that button and get it over with, but unfortunately, I can't. I have to drop down here, go into this cave, might as well grab this blue coin while I can, and get the turbo nozzle. Mario. Okay, I'm literally right where I need to be. Bring. Not possible to do without the turbo nozzle. But I'm pretty sure this is the only coins that you need to use the turbo nozzle for, so it's better to get them out of the way and then get back to the hover nozzle. Fire! And it didn't even have time to start shifting. 
Okay, now I can go back to the hover nozzle because I'm gonna need it. Now if you guys don't mind, I'm basically gonna head back to start. Because I'm gonna try to basically do the blue coins and the 100 coins here in this mission. So, I'm just gonna make sure that I basically get all the coins that I need to, where I need to, and how I need to. So, as you can see, there are trails of gold coins going all across the bay. Let's get them. I think that you're intended to either do this with a turbo nozzle or with the boat, but for me, both of them are too hard to control, so I think that it's better to just swim it. I mean, look at this beautiful crystal clear water. Who wouldn't want to swim here? And the best part about it is, there's not a stingray in sight. Ah, beautiful water. Not all murky and sandy and choppy like after a rainstorm. That seems like my family always has the ba the worst luck, because whenever we seem to go to the beach, it's always usually right after some kind of big storm or whatever. So by the time we get there, the beach just looks awful. Basically, the water has like all this sa all these sand particles churned up in it, making it all kind of murky and whatnot. And there's the fourth blue coin. So, mm, and everything just, well... And worse, basically, when it brings in, like, all the algae and stuff. Like, friggin' not ten, not friggin' two feet from the shore is, like, this entire surface layer of icky green sea stuff. Right. Well, I'm pretty sure that, uh... Those are the two blue coins on the bay. Now, I can go and do the ones over here, but first, I'm gonna break this guy's boxes. I'm gonna burst your boxes, raccoon. I'm gonna steal the coins. Alright, and now you see that trail of coins going down into the water? This is probably the deepest blue coin that we've had to get yet. I mean, don't get me wrong, we're going to go deeper, but... You follow this trail of blue coins all the way down, and keep an eye out for Big Bertha. She'll grab you and drag you down to the depths. And she has her way with them. That's how she likes to feed fresh blood. <laughs> you see... She put me in a wall. Hey, there's a one-up all the way down there. And that's our sixth blue coin. But I'm going for that one-up. <sighs> you see, she can't drag you down if you're already at the bottom. We, I was about to say, we are going to fucking make it. The waterfall forces you down. Alright, we are at 68 coins, and we, so far, only have friggin' six blue coins. So, 
I'm going to basically like open up my list to basically get some instructions on where the other coins might be. Mr. Rabbit. <laughs> Well, according to my instructions, I'm going to have to climb again. Well, I might as well do all the blue coins that are over on this side, because the ones that are over on the tricky ruins, that's going to be quite tricky. Hey, Sheldon. Believe me, no coin should be wasted in this in this coin hunt. Cuz odds are a single coin is going to be tr going to tip the scales. Right, need the rocket nozzle and it's all the way over here. It's the only thing that I don't like about Noki Bay is that the nozzles are in inconvenient locations. Seven. <laughs> Doo -doo -doo -doo. Mario, do I hear eight? I completely missed all of that. And I wasn't going to get the blue coin anyway. Looks like I need to jump. <laughs> gotcha. And now I have 78 coins. I am literally... More than a third of the way there. Well, more than two, th three thirds of the way there. I know math. Okay, so checking my instructions. I. Well, I'm gonna need the hover nozzle. So, I might as well do something while I'm all the way up here because I don't want to have to have come up here for nothing. Well, not necessarily nothing, but so little. And one up. But there's another gold button right there on the precipice of the waterfall. And if I am skilled enough, I'll be able to get it, all of them. I really shouldn't have butt slammed. Should have just jumped off the waterfall as intended. Oh well, hopefully there'll be at least nine coins up in the tricky ruins. But now that I've got the hover nozzle, I'm gonna have to go all the way back up there.
Okay, then you come all the way up here, drop to the water wheel, and... Hmm... There we go. <laughs> Convenient. And now comes a bit of a long climb, or at least a, a long shimmy. Quickly, shimmy up the cable. You're closest. You shimmy. Have you ever seen me shimmy? It's not pretty. <laughs> Just taking our rest here because believe it or not I actually tried this and I think that if you hang off of a ledge for too long Mario eventually gets fatigued stops moving from either side and eventually lets go so it's good to take a rest that's probably why those holes are there to begin with all right now Gotcha. And I think that makes 11. Yes. And now, I think that we're ready to move over to the really tricky ruins. Oh, yeah. Oh, I. Oh, goody, I got that magical musical sound. Alrighty. Alrighty, I think... I think I gotta get up to the top of those ruins. Man, they do not stay open for long, do they? Ah, 
Aha! Aha! Thirteen. And I think that 14 is conveniently close by. Waste not, want not. Eh. <laughs> Try this side first. Grab the ledge. Alright, I'm pretty sure that it's. Yep. Okay, uh. I have no idea how Mario actually made that jump, but I will take it. Let me see if I can. Oh. Okay, now where do I go for the, for number 15? Well, gotta open it up one last time. Oh man, I'm almost out of water. Hopefully the spring up there from where I fought Blooper is still there. This is more of a spring look. Ow, 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 ow. Coins? In the trees? Awesome! I'm about to get the shine, the hundred coin shine. Alrighty, now you just fly off to wherever it is you do and uh... Oh, that's a... Uh, that's an inconvenient place. <laughs> And you go down into the ruined tomb. <laughs> Owie! And that's 30, I think. No, wait. Nope, 31, because 50 coins. Spray that one. And I think that if you spray this one over here, another one. I think I'll spray the smaller ones too, just to see what happens. Nothing. Regular coin. Nothing. I can get out of here, right? <laughs> For a second there, I thought there was going to be a barrier there, and... Is it actually possible to get in there through there? Like, with a rocket nozzle? Anyway...
Ah, oh, great. I need the rocket nozzle again. I'll, uh... I'll just go get that. Seriously, why can't they have been put in a more convenient location? If I were to design a Mario Sunshine sequel, I'd basically like give it an upgrade system, kind of like uh, Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon had, to where basically if you can collect a certain... In fact, that's what I would use the blue coins for in a sequel. You Instead of basically exchanging them for shine sprites, you trade them for upgrades on the flood. Basically like that way, basically when you purchase a nozzle, you get to keep it. You can just switch to it at any moment. I mean, it's not like Luigi has to friggin' find the dark light in every single level that he's in. Why did the... My R button friggin' didn't work there. Jesus, sis, what did you do to this thing? Right. And now... I've got to get all the way over there. You see that square behind the friggin' conch shell? Well... Oh! I don't think that I can rock it up to there from here. Well, I could always try the tight ropes. Ooh! Okay, carefully, plumber. <laughs> camera! It feels like the camera at some times looks in random directions on its own. Alright, now remember, when you get up there, don't walk in. Okay, good. You're in a good position. You're on top of the conch shell. That way, you basically... Gotcha! That was an expert gaming move. Ooh, this is a trap. Ooh! <laughs> the thing about that trap is that it can only trap you once. Ow. Mario must... Mario must have a skull made of iron. Denim, denim, denim. Ooh. 
Secret tunnels! Secret tunnels! Nowhere else to go. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> well, I think that might be the last thing I need the rocket nozzle for. So, I'm gonna go get the hover nozzle now. How many more do I need? 18, so only 12 more. Kinda was hoping that it was already in the 20s, but... Say la vie. But wait, because there's basically four more that I don't need, that basically means that there's only twelve. That there's only uh, eight more that I need, at least from this level. Only eight more that I can get from this level. I mean. Why would that even be there? Oh, this is where I don't need to be. I'll I'll come back for you later. Yep. But at least this puts me in a elevated position. Just makes me really wish that Yoshi could be a part of this. Yep. Friggin' Brady Bunch squares right here. <sighs> Twenty-one. Right, so five more. Five, four, no! I needed to be there.
Alright. Made it. This is exactly where I needed to be. For a second I thought this game was going to screw me. Now which one was it? Hope this is the right one. Yep. <laughs> Come on, we gotta get back there before it all closes up. Oh no. No. How do I get back up there? Somebody hurt me. I, 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 I made it myself. <laughs> Wall jump, you were. <sighs> Grab the ledge. Bump, 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 bump. All right. Piece of cake. Now. Come on! Wait. Please, 
Please don't let that other one have been a blue coin. I don't want to have to go back up there. Whew. That other one was empty. Oh, wait. Looks like I still have to use... A... No, wait. I already got those coins up there. So then, which ones am I missing? Please tell me that I don't need the rocket nozzle again! Well, it looks like I already got that coin from up there. Unless... That wasn't where the coin actually was. I'm gonna get the rocket nozzle. How am I this low on health? And the worst part about it is, I've collected most, if not all, the coins in this world! Alrighty. Careful now.
Why didn't Mario... <sighs> Friggin' hate these fall physics. Come on! I need to go find some health. Gotta find some health. My armor's low. Why won't the bad guys just fucking die? Because if I... Okay, I have no choice. I'm basically going to have to come back to this level, or at least maybe episode 8, because I'm pretty sure that I can get it in episode 8 as well. I'm going to have to basically get the other, the, the last six blue coins there, because if I die now, and I'm nearly at, after, get, after the 100 coin shine sprite has been just floating up there, just waiting for me, I'm pretty sure that I will friggin' snap. Camera, turn that way, please. <laughs> that would have been disastrous if I hit anything else but the rope or the water. Already disastrous. How the heck did I did I get hurt from so falling such a short distance? Oh my god. My little black heart can't take much more of this. Just makes me wish that you could basically emerge from the depths in episode 8 once you're done with the whole 
coin fish. Okay, so we're gonna go back in. This is what I get for thinking that this level might actually be easy, because this was the easiest blue coins and 100 coins that I basically have done thus far. Okay, first things first. Need friggin' rocket nozzle. Wish was in more convenient place. Really need to punch Egad in face for that. Because seriously, why the heck are the nozzles in such out of the way places in this place? Who bought them? Who shipped them here? So that's a tip. If you ever fall, basically just uh, press the B button and basically like go into a dive and make sure you hit a wall because hitting the wall basically I think resets your momentum when you're falling. More rocket nozzle. Please tell me that I didn't do all this for nothing. Alright, you idiot. Where's my rocket nozzle? Is the turbo nozzle even down there? Nope. I didn't mean to do that. Okay, since I'm here, I might as well friggin' go get the other friggin' blue coins since I apparently can't friggin' get the rocket nozzle in this level. Way to make me look like an ass game. As you can see, the four remaining blue coins, or what was supposed to be the four last remaining blue coins, are basically on top of four pillars in this l in this l in this under sea area under the sea under the sea mm. well during the showing I can't keep going cause Disney will copyright me copyright me he <laughs> he Uh, 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 uh. 
Right, that's three. Right. Those are the last four blue coins, but need to friggin' go back. I need to go back. I am not happy right now. I'm forcing myself to smile. I think what I'm really not happy about is the fact that I've basically been home for a few hours after work, and I've only basically ever just... I still haven't friggin' finished recording one friggin' episode of Mario Sunshine. I hate work days. Why can't friggin... Why? the one on top of it. That's 29. Now if you guys will excuse me, I need to basically consult. Wait a second. I already got that one. Right, I got that one. Got that one. Definitely got this one. I got these two. Got that one. Got that one. Got that. Got that one. Got this one. Got 
Got that one. And that one. Got that one. Got that one. That one. And that one. Please don't tell me that the one that I'm missing was down there. Oh! Mario, land on your bottom. It'll push off at the impact of the fall. You mean like this? You mean like this? No, your other bottom! Don't you have to be stupid somewhere else? Not until four. Well, it's clear that I've gotten the coin from there. Now I know that I got the coins from the Brady Bunch. The Brady Bunch blocks. It looks like those are the only coins that I, that's the only coin that I have left. Because it's the only way that, it's the only place where I couldn't technically go. Okay, simple. And if this is the coin that I'm missing, then it will be in a rather convenient place. Let's go up! Gotcha. Gotcha! And that's all 30. Whew! I, only, I didn't give up, I just needed to basically, like, make sure that I didn't die, because then all my hard work will have gone to waste. Whoop! I'm diving in. And now, in order to leave this place, let's go get that secret shine. You head back on up here. As you can see, there is a yellow bird flying around. I wish that we had Yoshi, because as we've seen, blue birds have blue coins, green birds have yellow coins. Hold on. So, what does a yellow bird have? A shine sprite. And I'm pretty sure that that's like one of maybe two sh maybe two golden birds in the game. So, that is the Shine Sprites of Rico Harbor and the Blue Coins of Rico. Oh, Noki Bay, sorry. I don't know where I am. That's the Blue Coins of Noki Bay and the Secret Shine Sprites of Noki Bay. And now that I have all 30, I'm going to go collect my fee. Do do do. Do do do. Choo! Oh no! 
Yeah! Oi! Oh, 71 shines. Well, that is a good place to end off this episode. Don't worry, I'm going to trim in places here or there. Maybe I might be able to get this one under an hour. So, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please leave a comment down in the comment section below. Share, like, and share with your friends. You want to keep up to date with more Super Mario Sunshine coming at you in the future. Then be sure to smash that subscribe button and ring that bell for notifications. And as always, I will catch you guys in the next video. Later!